Again, I gotta be careful. I don't smack things. My play space is kind of small. Swing enemy with fist or weapon equipped to melee attack. All right, we got this. Is there anything in front of me? All right. Come on. You little shit. <clears throat> Giant roaches? What the hell? Take another baton? Why not? Klepto, everything. Mine! Oops. Track pad got stuck there for a minute. Mine. 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 <laughs> Never seen a fallout at all. You want it red in all? Of course you have. You were one of the first people here when I played Fallout 4 the very first time, kind of at the start of my streaming. But I'll read more of them. But you know, we want to get some flavor of the game, right? Instead of me just I'm facing away from everyone, aren't I? No, nope. walls behind me. All right. I have to like feel where the green screen is, so I know where you guys are. Get that ceramic. Oh. Where'd that go? Oh, there it is. I steal fucking everything. Don't let a klepto into your into your vault. That's all I'm saying. Oh. Overseer memo. Remember, use of recreational terminal is privilege. If work performance declines, this privilege will be revoked. Enjoy responsibly. Top ten. Oops. Let's eject the holotape. There we go. Got it. Gimme, gimme, gimme! Nope. This valve supplies oxygen to all chambers. Alright. Don't touch that, huh? That is a weird looking shower. Alright. The toilet needs cleaned. Seriously! Manager! Let's see. Where am I facing? Alright, let's turn this around a bit. So I'm facing you guys. Somehow I still have a flashlight. Well, that red roach just got bit. Sure, again, there's nothing in front of me. Don't you do it! There go. Oops. I hit the vats. Raise your melee weapon or hands to block. Son of a bitch, aren't you? Come on. Come on. Ugh. Jesus, right in my fucking face. <laughs> Track pad got stuck again. Hi. What happened here? Where is everyone? Mine.
hold right trigger and swing for a power attack. <laughs> Give me those sweetmeats. You gonna bring it? Bring the paint! <laughs> <laughs> Moon gets re Moon gets that recently often, no biggie. Yeah, I do. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. I get it pretty often, so don't worry. I've been androgynous most of my life, so. Oops. Mine. Mine. Simpax heal over thirty percent. Store thirty percent health. Yeah, we know that. This all that's left? Is anyone alive? Here. I can't pick you up. Did anyone get out? Select favorite. Oh, yeah, let's see what it's telling me. So if I do this, I have my security baton. Of mine. I will take those glasses. Thank you. Anything else in there? Let's check the terminal. Vault 111 Overseer Instructions. Confidential. 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 Vault 111 is designed to test the long term effects. Okay, we saw this. Under no circumstance. Da da da. We read this. Under no circumstance is suspension to be disrupted. This includes. The administration of life-saving measures. Your staff is also considered expendable insubordination or attempts to evacuate prematurely are capital violations. Unused cryogenic pods are preferred method for cadaver disposal. The cryolator. I've long dreamed of making a cryogenic freezing available in a portable on-demand form. The cryolator is my latest attempt. Thankfully, there are no we are no short supply of chemical components I need to tinker with the prototype. It's a nice way to occupy the time as we wait for all, the all-clear signal. Residence admins, all-clear, and evacuation. Following the nuclear event, vault Tech will monitor hazards such as radiation levels, enemy invasion, subsequent attacks, and other factors. One condition, once conditions are deemed safe, this terminal will receive an all-clear notice. Upon receiving the all-clear notice, vault Tech personnel may be evacuated at overseer discretion. Disregard any notices from organizations or individuals not associated with vault Tech, including government and military. Residents are not to be disrupted or evacuated. vault Tech will attend to their needs remotely once Vault 111 staff has been evacuated. Mandatory shelter period. Vault 111 is classified as a short-term assignment. Non-resident personnel are expected to carry out research duties and basic maintenance of the vault while waiting the all-clear signal to evacuate. In the absence of an all-clear message from Vault Tech, the overseer may elect to evacuate staff after a mandatory shelter period of 180 days of containment. Under no circumstance may Vault 111 staff evacuate during this shelter period. Unless receiving an all clear message from Vault Tech. How's it going? You're liking that it's not teleporting? By default, it's, um,. By default, it does teleport, but you can set it up so you don't teleport. For people that get motion sick, though. <laughs> yeah, poor Rick. When he tried to get the last, Zer the the first Zern's folly key, he didn't get it. Well, keep putting in those tickets if you got them. If you want to really win it, you gotta win it to something, something. Alright. 
Overseer's log. This is the important one. Scroll up. There we go. Preparations. The final staff orientation is complete. All, all but a few of the residents are down in Sanctuary Hills have been enrolled, and several from Concord as well. Vault Tech supervisors came up this week to do a technical review with me. This vault is ready to open. I can only imagine what wonders our residents will get to witness. What our residents will get to witness. The notion of leaping forward in time. I almost wish I could join them and see the promise of our future realized. October 23rd. It's happened. We're lucky that most of the staff was nearby when the early warning came through. We had less notice than expected, but only Nordhagen was missing when we sealed the entrance. Residents admittance went smoothly. Everyone made it, even the family that waited until the last minute. I was worried there would be more suspicion. But think... Sorry, got an itchy nose. <laughs> but things happen so fast for these people, they must have been too overwhelmed to question the cryogenic pod. Strange issue today with pod C3. Subject appeared to be having heart palpitations. Nothing life-threatening, but unusual. We realized almost too late that the pod was malfunctioning. The cryogenic array almost started thawing her out. We're not sure, but I suspect a hiccup in Vault Tech's remote override systems um, may have sent an errant signal. We'll have to keep an eye out. I only hope their systems are reliable once we evacuate the staff. There's been no all-clear signal yet, even though we're nearing the end of the 180-day mandatory shelter period. Supplies were never intended to last much more than that, and despite my best efforts, people are beginning to question what we're doing down here. If people think we can just leave when the 180 days, 180 days are up, they're insane. The radioactive exposure would still be potent enough to fry everyone if the vault seals were breached that early. The whole point of the all clear was to receive additional instructions from the main office. I don't know what to do. I can't open the vault. I can't expect our supplies to last forever. I just... I have to keep everything under control until the all clear. Mutiny. The faction led by the security personnel have turned on me, demanding they be allowed to leave the vault. Idiots. I will not open the door to be irradiated to death out there. I'm, cons I'm consolidating the remaining supplies, putting the staff on lockdown. We're going to have to start prioritizing who deserves what little food we have left. I've been too damn generous with the rations. People don't like it? Well, there's fewer mouths to feed. There you go. There's what happened. The personnel evacuation tunnel is now open. Remind all staff to be orderly and follow shutdown protocols before exiting and resealing Vault 11. Please maintain the staff record and research and research. Report your, to your local Vault Tech superiors for debriefing and further instructions. We're in the open. Hi guys, what you doing? I missed some of the chat, so. All right, all right, let's see. The cry later, we'll have to come back for that. Ammo, ammo, gun. Some people, someone said, oh, you can. <laughs> Look at this. Me thinks that, um, that, uh, Bethesda didn't think about this. I can literally just reach in and take the damn thing. I'm not going to, though. That's cheating. We're not going to do that. Nice. Coming back later for you. <laughs> I could just take it now. Whoops. Bethesda missed something. I can just pick up the cry later. When I was looking for solutions to try to fix the, 
the the issues that this game is having. Someone said you can just pick up the cryolator by reaching in. Alright, there's nothing left in here. So yeah. Not gonna cheat. I'll I'll do it legit, of course. I think you I think you can bring dog meat down and he can grab it too. Now, here's where things get complicated because of a little bit of blur. The iron sights are a bit hard to see. These things get a bit pixely. Oops, I pissed it off. Damn it! Got it. <laughs> so the, it seems it's very hard to do that at long distance because it seems to cause the glow which with the slight blur issue I'm having um, kind of overwrites the visual on the iron sights I have but Now I can crouch. There we go. How you guys doing? Now, oh, where's the wall? Again, I gotta make sure because there's desks in front of me. Sneak. For melee attacks while we're using the gun, oh yeah. I can swing things as well. Everyone's dead. You can see there. That. Everyone's dead. So where is everyone? Everyone's dead. Okay. Hammer time. Here, I'm just gonna uh look, it's VLC, right? Here we go. Give me that baby. Look at this. So yeah, when you bring it up, it gets larger so you can read it. I think you can turn that off too, and then when it's down at my side. But yeah, so you can read it better. So what do we got? Let's see. Let's put on these glasses. Not that you'll see him. And take off this damn wedding ring. Let's put on the new jumpsuit. I don't know how to zoom out. Oh, that's how you do it. And radio. All right, there we go.
All right. Let me know. Let's see, what time is everything posting? Should still be some time. All right. Let's do it. Yeah, do the little pluggy thing. Vault door cycling sequence initiated. Please stand back. I want to look at this. I'm in a fucking vault, okay? I'm playing one of my favorite franchises of all time in VR. Nope, I will keep everything as it is. Enjoy your return to the surface. My face. And thank you for choosing Vault Tech. So yeah, here's where you might start to see things being a bit blurry, especially if I look down over here. Things to me look exceptionally blurry in the distance, like really blurry. Um, again, that's supposed to be an incoming fix, hopefully, but I can deal with it. My weapon. doing well yeah sorry excuse me nuka cola I will take that baby So everything. What do we got? Right away in a paintbrush. Okay, stop that mess. Can I pick you up? No, I can't. Can't pick this up. I'm taking this, alright? Why does this look like snow? Why does the water look like snow? Whoa! Oh, you little shit. Yeah, I'm not teleporting, so... I don't have the teleport option. Elevator is still buzzing. Yeah. 
Hi, how's it going in here? Don't think I don't see that. Cram. Take that as well. Mine! Mine. Mine. Especially ceramics. You end up needing ceramics a lot late. later. Nothing. I'll take the ammo. Stepping on cords! Switchblade. Hang on. In inventory time, you can favor items by pressing... Gonna stab ya! <laughs> stabby, stabby! Sorry. None of y'all made it, huh? Just walk over the bones, it'll be fine. First mod you downloaded is Weightless Junk. I think some people are saying, now, Bethesda isn't officially supporting mods for this. Hang on, where am I? Yeah, Bethesda is not officially supporting mods, but people have been reporting that mods work, so. Which I expect. Which, I, I mean, if the DLC ends up not, um, you know, getting ported to this, I imagine people will mod it. Flower. Oh, look at this place is a shape. Damn it, Cod's wallop. What have you been doing? Hi. As I live and breathe. You do neither. Oh, it's it's really you. Codsworth, you're still here. So other people could still be alive too. Well, of course I'm still here. Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International. But you seem the worst for wear. Best not let the hubby see you in that state, huh? Where is Sir, uh, by the way? He uh, went out to get some milk and never came back. <laughs> can't imagine what people would do in Fallout VR. Yeah, there could be some interesting mods that would uh, crop up from that. Mom, you were going to say? I'm talking to... Whatever. They... They killed him. Oh, Mom, these things you're saying, these terrible things, I... I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction. To <sighs> Never believe the woman, right? Dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or, or perhaps charades. Oh, Sean does so love that game. <laughs> is, is the lad uh, with you? He's in, he's in the freezer. It doesn't make sense. There's just no reason someone would take my baby. It's worse than I Because I didn't want him. Why would anyone else? You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. 
really. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? 200 years? What? Are you sure? A bit over 210, actually, Mum. Give or take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. Sometimes people withhold information off caps. So let's give it a go. Codsworth, you're acting... A little weird. What's wrong? I... I... Uh, Mom, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house and the car the car how do you polish rust why did you let it rust that seems on you stop it get to the point i'm afraid i don't know anything mum the bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry I thought for certain you and your family were were dead. I I did find this hollow tape. Well, careful with that. I believe Sir was going to present it to you as a as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. A hollow tape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it myself. Oh, saucy. standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pit boy on your arm. The one that, that should work. <laughs> grows really like a tumor. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual mum. Pesky neighborhood. Dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? Did you say mosquitoes? Ah, <sighs> goodness. Getting caps faster than moon and fallout. <laughs> fall <laughs> yeah, that's that's why caps are my currency. Distracted a bit today, Mom? All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mum. Maybe let's not use the knife for this. Though he's gonna do everything. harder to do in uh, not in VR or in VR I actually have to aim Miss McFly hmm. your family isn't here either they're, they're really gone aren't they happy this whole thing was a waste of time I only wanted to help mom but maybe you could try Concord I've seen people in that area, and they're only slightly heavily armed. Slightly? I like these people already. Oh, good. Maybe you'll get along then. 
they can help you find young Sean. I shall remain here and secure the home front. <sighs> How's it going? this junk here because I'm gonna need to find a storage place where I can dump some shit. Nothing to loot. It's like they've looted everything. Again, <laughs> so easy for me just to turn around and lose which direction I'm actually facing. That. A little more bloat flies right there. That one had caps. I got caps. The basement. Again, at this point, we won't take too much junk. God, the frame suddenly jumped up when I'm down here, but I guess I'm in a closed. Gold bar, I will take that. If I only had a bobby pin. this a VR game that I can play for a long time. Assuming they fix some of the issues with it. Right, let's go put some stuff away so I'm not carrying just an insane amount of shit. Plus there might be stuff in here. Ooh, bobby pins. Um, let's see here. How do I... There we go.
Mars. There, that should keep me light. There we go. Hi. Entries have stopped. Okay, there we go. <laughs> you just timed that just right. Alright. So that means it's time to do the giveaway. Right, which way? Which way, guys? <laughs> this way? That's the wall behind me? Okay. Do the next giveaway. <laughs> Take the controllers off. Okie dokie. Let me swap my cams here. Hello, how you doing? Time that just right. Okay, so we ready. We ready to do the next giveaway. We got some people in this one. Some people are in this one to win it. Wake Luna, Digi Beast, and Taco Kitty. We're all vying for this one. For a copy of Cosmonautica. Are we ready to do this? Alright, ready to do this. Here we go! Picking a winner. As soon as I belt, sorry. Picking a winner in three. So again, the countdowns are pointless because you guys have to catch up to me. Here we go! Wake a Luna! One Cosmonautica. Congratulations! I will mark that down as you being the winner. Okay, so next up on the list and the last giveaway we are doing today is for the final key I have of Zarin's Folly. We played this one on stream. Really good game. There's rec recently an addition to the game. I highly recommend it. The dev had sent me three keys. This is the last of the three keys that I have to give away. Um, how long do we want to set this for? We'll set this one because we're pretty much right on time now. So I will set This one, open giveaway. And then I have change. If you want, yeah, caps, there you go. All right, yeah, don't forget to pick up your daily caps. Just type daily. You get 100 free caps to join the raffle, if that's what you want to do. So, yeah, we're giving away the last copy of uh, the last key for Zarin's Folly that I have. Really good platformer game. Fast-paced, funny, good story. It's good. It's got a few lewd moments in it, a little bit of adult content in it, not like... Well, there's a small bit of nudity in it, but... Um a bit of lewd humor, but it's actually a really good story, and um, really enjoyable. All made by a single person. The controls are really good, so highly recommend it. Alright, so yes. One hour, that raffle will close. That will also be about the end of my stream if I decide to stop. <laughs> and, um, oh yeah, let's swap my cameras back. Hello. See my hand. There we go. And um, 
Yep, last raffle of the day. And again, I do say this with a bit of a disclaimer. Aside from the Zarin's Folly keys, um, the keys should work. If they don't, I will do my best to make sure they do work. But if they don't, I'm sorry, but you didn't pay any real money for them, so... But I will do my best if your keys aren't working. I know Taco Kitty has a key that's not working, and I will try to get that one working for them. So, all right, let me put my headset on. There we go. Locked back into the wasteland. Nose pieces showing. See, this thing fits over my glasses, but of course every time I put it on, it shuffles my glasses a bit. There we go. So yes, you can wear a Vive headset if you wear glasses. And in fact, you ha I always find it amazing that you actually have to wear glasses if you wear glasses, I'm saying. Because I tried wearing a headset one time without glasses and it was actually blurry. So there you go. All right. So the last raffle's going. And now we're going to go. Oh yeah, I need to go. Don't forget this thing. You are special. What do I want to improve? I forget what points I actually have. Always go charisma, right? Oh no, my child's gone. I don't give two shits. <laughs> that was the one big problem with Fallout 4 that everyone had, was that you never got a chance to really get to know the child and your husband or wife, depending on which character you play. So, you legit didn't care about the main storyline because you had no general attachment to the child. But other than that, the game is great. I love Fallout 4. It's it's really, really good. Aside from the not caring about the child. Alright, Cods, wallop! I'm gonna get the frig out of here. But not without checking a computer first. Remember, oh yeah, I can jump if I hit the trigger on that handle. There you go. Whoa! Shit, that's the back wall. <laughs> Ooh, that's big. I didn't realize I was facing the back wall and I went to put my hand out and I just punched the wall. I didn't hit it hard though, don't worry. Got it. Cola cherry. Still never got my Nuka Cola. Rick, we're gonna have to get that next time. You know that, right? <laughs> You're gonna play again soon? What? Fallout 4? Man, I was—I've been dying for Fallout 4. I've just been waiting for this VR. I'm just—I'm disappointed that there's blur. But again, I can deal with it. So. Hopefully, hopefully there's a patching coming. I'll be kind of upset if there's not. Alright, how does this work? Adjust the bobby pin by swiping that and that. Press trigger to rotate the screwdriver. The spot is correct. The lock will rotate and open. The lock resists. Release trigger and swipe. Okay, so this is how I gotta do it. Okay. Bit tricky to see. Yes. Got it. More bobby pins. Fishing rod. And a laundered green dress. That I can't be seen wearing. Like, literally, you can't see me wearing it. It's the only downside. This 
room doesn't have anything in it. I know one of these has a safe in it. I remember that much. There's also this. Flip lighter and screwdriver. Again, we'll save a lot of the stuff that's here because it's just junk. But I can put it away later. Hello? <laughs> Leaning while actually moving. I like that you can you can shoot around corners, which is really cool. I'm not actually sure what my hitbox is. Is my hitbox my head? Because it does seem like everything kind of comes from my head, so... That's that in front of me. Okay, again. It's easy to turn around so dang much. Wiggler comes home to holes in the wall. Wires <laughs> tossed everywhere. <laughs> On a quiet day. Just need to add some more outfits. Yeah. That's the only, again, that's the only downside to VR. You can't customize your character, but there's no real point. Because I'm my character. So no big loss. Take that pistol. Cooking oil. We'll keep there. That safe is rigged, right? Just on the bomb. There we go. All right, let's do some hacking. Well, that's a bit difficult to see because it's a bit see-through. Hacking. Select a potential password by swiping on that. All right. Chosen password is incorrect. All right. Likeness one. G E D. Nope. Bill. Nothing. All right. Not to be at the start. High strung and needs to relax. I keep telling him that, uh, keep telling him that, offering to help, but so far, no dice. By the looks of the guy, he's self medicating with pie. Baker. My favorite tinfoil hat wearing nut job, good for seven ampules of day tripper a week. I guess he is a one a day kind of guy. Whatever helps the man groove. Rosa. Still trying to get her some buff out. Uh, still trying to get her some buff out. Didn't expect the rationing to affect this, but it is what it is. Jahani. He wants something called Psycho. I'm not sure the stuff even exists. And even if it does, do I really want this Neanderthal using it? Guess it depends on how much he's willing to spend. But, I su but I'll put out some feelers out to an army connection to see where that goes. They still owe me for that last Excel delivery. Occurred to me. What is it? What is it? What even? Was it even for them? Because, so help me God, if I find out that they're juicing up the dogs, we're going to be having some words about more than money. But we're probably beyond words anyway. I know they have a floor safe in there. I've seen it. Master bedroom under the dresser. Can't be that tough to crack. All right, there was a... One under there. Concord. Still good for a couple hits of daddy-o a week. Pretentious pseudo-intellectual asshole. 
But his money's good. Williams wants medics as much as I can get. Hasn't told me why, not really my business. Guessing there's some sort of long-term pain management going on. Disease? Anders. Kids, kids are usually a no-go, but this girl's got style, and she's not interested in getting tweaked. Order 20 blood packs, some Halloween stunt or something. Or hell, maybe she's just a vampire. What do I care? She's She's got her daddy's money. Boston. Isaacs. Some student CIT wants day tripper XL an entire pallet, yes, pallet of Mentats. Not sure if it's so hard to see because there's it's the opacities alone, and I'm seeing the background behind it. Maybe if I turn this way. Oh, that helps a lot. There we go. Um, not sure if he's going doing crazy experiments, dealing to the other eggheads, or on the verge of a nervous breakdown. Don't care as long as the money's good. Ward. Young married couple. Good for a couple good for a couple day trip per week. Easy order, cool people, no brainer. Cop. Long time buff out customer, run into supply problems. We've had a good thing for years, I'd hate to end it now, and I don't exactly want to risk him getting all noble and law abiding if he can't get what he wants. That would be a very that would end very badly for me. The old lady has upped her daddy order. Weird, but profitable. Malcolm. Potential new customer in Charleston. Charlestown. Once meta X seems oddly desperate. Might be a comp trying too hard. Need to move slowly. Underwear model from Braintree. Beautiful, intelligent, totally weird. And she's... All she's ever wanted is stim, ta stim packs. Ten per week. My imagination continues to run wild. Nice. <laughs> Contextual. Alright, here we go. A bit tricky to see, actually. Again with the blur. Damn it. It's also very hard to do like the, the slow trigger. Nice! Rounds, pipe pistol, pre-war money, shotgun shells, and a silver tablespoon. Mine! Mine, oh mine. You guys doing? 